56 Precision Forecast Center. Meteorologist Michael Fish. Thanks for being with us tonight. Pretty nice summer-like night. If you live closer to Lake Michigan, of course, it's a little bit cooler, but a lot of us in the 80s, and guess what? That's where we should be, in the 80s, on average. Our average high temperature in the 80s, the next time that average high, meaning like every day we should pop into the 80s, the next time the average high goes back into the 70s, meaning we should only make it to 70 something every day, is in about four weeks. What I'm basically saying here is in about four weeks, it starts cooling down towards fall. <laughs> Yikes. I'm sure you don't want to talk about that. Now, listen, I have plenty of summer like temperatures in the forecast. I'll get to that in a bit. 80, the average high. Above 80 today, and as far as around here, above average. Now, look at the 90s out to the west. No, we're not going to quite make it into the 90s, but it's still going to be pretty warm around here. We have middle 80s in Sioux Falls. Uh, we got 87 in St. Louis. It's going to be pretty warm where it is right now. Shawano, Green Bay, 87, 88 in Wapaka, but our air is doing one of these. I understand if you live in Kiwani County, parts of Manitowoc, Sheboygan County, it is cooler by the lake. Nature's air conditioning for you. But again, it is not bad. If you like summer, this is your kind of weather. Now, as far as dew points, if you like summer, these are your kind of dew points. Middle 60s. And by the way, pooling kind of around a front, we have dew points that go into like the upper 60s, lower 70s. Those are going to be slowly moving on in. That's pretty humid air. So you're going to notice summer-like humidity around here for days. Now, satellite and radar, don't worry about the humidity tonight because most of us, especially further south you live, the drier are going to be rain-wise. But, of course, there still will be some humidity out there, a little bit muggy night, even muggier tomorrow night. But notice this rain. Now, this is a weak front. It's going to get closer and closer, and some of those showers might affect our far northern counties as the night goes on. But again, we're fine right now, but notice it's getting a little bit closer. Nothing heavy. We could just see a shower, maybe a thunderstorm, especially the further north you live as the night goes on. But I'm not talking about an all-night rain. Right now, your evening is just fine. But that rain is getting a little bit closer. So as far as Sunday is concerned, we have a low pressure passing to our north, a weak cool front sliding on through, and as it does, could bring us a stray shower or thunderstorm. Not an all-day event. So here we are in precision cast. As far as a lot of our night, okay. But again, to the north, you could see maybe a shower or two, maybe a thunderstorm as the night goes on. Tomorrow, here comes that front rolling on through. It's a weak front. And that means that we're just going to keep it as a chance of rain. This isn't like a powerful front where there are 60s behind it. We have 80s in front of it where it uh, kind of clashes. You go boom. That's not the case with this one. It's just going to be tracking on through with a chance of rain. That chance of rain continues tomorrow night. And then Monday, Oh, one of these warm fronts going to be hanging around. When we have a situation like this in summer in Wisconsin, you just can't say the storm is going to fire up at this time here, track on through, then you wait this time. It fires up when it wants to along these fronts. Once they fire up, then you track them on through. That'll be our case as we go into early next week. But as far as tonight, mostly clear to partly cloudy to the south, a storm possible to the north as the night goes on. For our Sunday, Chance of a couple scattered storms with that front rolling on through. Not an all-day event for Sunday night. Another chance of a thunderstorm with that front rolling through. Most of Monday, okay, a slight chance of a thunderstorm. It's going to be warm and humid, though. At least for us, 86. And that chance of rain, again, with that warm front hanging around, going to continue on Tuesday, possibly into the morning Wednesday. But after that, actually, Cassandra, we yeah, make things a little bit cooler around here, a little bit more comfortable. But enjoy these summer-like temperatures and humidity next couple of days.